The pose that we'll be doing today is a seated piriformis stretch. So while you're sitting in your chair, what you're going to do is you'll take your right leg to start and really kind of just press that foot into the ground. Kind of keep yourself a little bit stable there. And then lift the left leg high up and over that right knee, okay? And you'll want to sit up nice and straight and tall. So the shoulder blades are down the back, collarbones are lifted. Take the left hand to the knee and the right hand to the foot. Just press down gently and lean forward. Lean forward, lean forward, until you really feel that stretch, the maximum amount of stretch that you can handle. You don't want to go past that, but you also want to feel something too. And hold that for 10 seconds to start, and then back off. Lower that foot to the ground, kind of get that foot stable, press into it just a little bit, lift the right leg up, left hand to the foot, right hand to the knee, press down gently, lift up through the chest, and come forward. You might notice that one side, you can stretch a little bit deeper than the other, that's fine. Like I said, you wanna take it to where the stretch, it's at your max, don't go past that. Hold that 10 seconds as well and then come out. And then return the leg to the ground. You want to repeat that three to five times, maybe one time a day, um, and take it to your max. Make sure you feel something in the sides of the legs here into the glutes, um, but no pain, no shooting pain, no sharp pain. If that occurs, that's you want to back off of that completely. But that'll complete the seated piriformis stretch.